Hi, my name is Simon and this is Weird. I'm a big fan of cartoons and animations. One of my favorite is Adventures from Moomin Valley, a 1990 TV series based on the stories of a Finnish author, Tove Jansson. Despite its really gorgeous style and animation, the Adventures of Moomins hide a lot more mysteries than an average kid's cartoon. It's definitely a weird one and if you didn't watch it yet, I strongly recommend it. The world of Moomins is a strange place. The characters are interesting, weird, seem to have a deeper meaning and hide a lot of secrets. Today I prepared a list of 5 things you didn't know about the Moomins. Number 1. Hidden meaning of the Grog. In episode 6, titled Tiny Guests, we meet two new characters, Thingami and Bob. Very small frightened creatures that are running away from something, while also carrying a baggage way too heavy for them, trying to hide what's inside it. While the English version of their names are feminine and masculine, their original Swedish names are Tofslan and Vislan, which are both feminine forms of Swedish names. Both these names were used by Tove Jansson in the letters between her and Vivica Bandler, her first love, forbidden love. Vivica did not want to disclose their passionate affair, considering she had a husband. So Tove, with sadness, had to take various measures to ensure that while sending the letters. The Finnish author decided to write their story of affair into the Moomin Valley, where Thingami and Bob are living in fear of hiding their precious secret, running away from the Grog, a symbol of a threat to their hidden love and passion. Both the characters and Tove with Vivica talked to each other using their own language. After having a look into their private correspondence, the hidden meaning of the characters becomes very apparent. Their relationship didn't last long due to Vivica not wanting to leave her husband. Later, Tove found out that Vivica had also many different female lovers. Number 2. Dreadful Moomin Troll The word Moomins, in Swedish Moomin Troll, was first heard by Tove when she was young and living with her beloved uncle Einar in Stockholm. When sneaking into the kitchen for a night snack, her uncle tried scaring her with the Moomin Trolls living in the cupboard and behind the stove. They pressed their cold noses against your leg and blew cold air down your neck, he said. Since then, the Moomins stuck with Tova. In her journals, she started to use them as a metaphor for something frightening and dreadful. Number 3. From Philosopher to the Moomin at first, when she drew the moments, it didn't remind of the current form we can see in the animated adaptations. Her inspiration was a stump in the woods, covered with snow, hanging in a way that reminded her of a big white nose. The first drawing was created on the wall of an outhouse after her heated philosophical quarrel over Immanuel Kant with her brother. What's supposed to be a caricature of the philosopher Immanuel Kant above the slogan freedom is the best thing turned out to be the beginning of the movement's creation. Number 4. Band Episodes Although the story Tove created was getting more and more popular abroad, its peculiarity couldn't pass in notice. Some of the countries wanted to translate their own versions of the novel on their own terms. Controversial characters and their strange adventures often were the subject of fierce discussions with the publishers and agents. The British were outraged by the phallic shape and weird behavior of the Hattifnaders, while the Germans wanted the Moomins to say prayers before going to winter sleep. Even the toilet paper on which Moomin Papa was writing down his notes was supposed to be replaced with kitchen towels. In Scandinavia, a lot of episodes were banned unaired or aired once and taken off. The reason was always the same. They thought to be too scary for the audience. There is even a rumor of a very tragic final episode that aired only in Japan and was censored immediately as it was too disturbing to watch for kids and allegedly it was a reason for five of the kids to commit suicide. Number 5. Studying the Moomins Creation of the Moomins by Tove Jansson 
is so interesting and rich in endless content and hidden meaning that it led to publishing great number of scientific papers on that subject. The papers focus on many different aspects of her creation. They discuss the nostalgia of the created world, different literary traditions and intertextuality or different translation of the movement characters. A fair amount of people try to figure out the secrets hiding in all the characters living in the strange imagination of the woman responsible for their creation. Leave a like if you want more videos about the movements. I barely scratched the interesting stuff about this incredible work of art. What do you think about the adventures from Moomin Valley? Did it scare you as a kid? Leave a comment below and subscribe for more content.